All right, it's really windy out here, so just leave it at that. I spent about ten dollars on food and it didn't really taste that good. <clears throat> Feels like such a waste at this Whole Foods market. That's quite a majestic mountain in the background there. So I've gone to the library and 
It's closed today. What a bad time to get kicked out of one library. I was I was reading about uh, some library closures today. Like they're observing New Year's for two days. And I, I recall reading about Passeo, or whatever, this library. But uh, I didn't think about it much until I got here. And then I was like, oh yeah, I read that. That was closed. <clears throat> closed all day because of New Year's. That's that's part of the reason why I wanted to stay at that other library, but how do you rectify how do you rectify a, a bad smell complaint? I, I don't know. Like I step out and then step back in and say I'm cured. I don't have anywhere to go. I mean what do I do? Do does she does she make uh, like a, a determination if I smell good enough to be in the library or not? I just I don't understand how how you could come to a, a negotiation a point in, a point where you can both agree on uh, the smell whether it's whether it's good enough or not. How do you do that? It's so offensive to have to deal with that. That's why some libra librarians just kind of put out an air freshener and call it good enough. I think they have the most sense because the ones that come up to you and tell you you stink. How do you how do you how do you respond to that? It's crazy. I'm just at a loss for the best way to respond to something like that.